Well, if that includes being interrupted by my child and dog, we did it in about an hour and a half. That's not bad, though. It's not bad. It's not bad. 15 minutes. Okay, that's not bad. No, it was like, it was like 30. I, uh, I actually, uh, yeah, I had someone do my makeup, and that was, I tried to do it myself today. I thought it was going to be a thing, and it just was not. <laughs> so I had, How often do you do makeup? Uh, I, not all of them, but I felt like if I'm going to do it, I got to do, you know, throw a little concealer on. But I just totally messed it up when I tried it myself, so I had to have someone fix it for me. What the heck's going on there? Nails by China on Instagram. She's in Orange County. She's the best. I can't wash my hair. I can't go to the toilet. I can't do anything in these nails. So they're probably going to come off after tonight, but they're cute, right? For a night. For a night. Yeah. My girl was so quick. It probably took like an hour and a half. That's not too bad. Yeah. An hour and a half for these gorgeous nails. I'll take it. And how long did it take you overall to get ready? To get ready? Oh, I'm a little embarrassed. It took me like three and a half hours. But you know, we like had we had dinner in between and we were like chatting and we were like, you know, dancing and singing. So I guess it's not exactly three and a half hours, but it took a while because I'm a full beat kind of girl. <laughs> Me, Lexi and Lisa all got a big hotel room together to do glam together, side by side. I think we got there at like three. I think I started at like three thirty. It's a couple hours, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> a couple hours and several people. Hi. <laughs> yeah, I had the outfit. We pulled it together. We pulled it together. You look amazing. Thank you. You look fun. It's giving body. Thank you. Oh, is it? Thank you. <laughs> there was one summer that I went to an, a theater camp when I was in like high school. And, you know, at this point, I just, you know, I'd acted in a couple things and I was always playing like the young kid and, and stuff. And they put a huge wig on me and a fake beard and I played this old, decrepit man for two months at a summer camp. They should have done that in Girls They should have. I, I think so. But that was quite the experience to spend the whole summer playing an old, decrepit man at like 14 years old. I, I aged. Oh yeah, that was that was the maturing you know event in my life. Swimming in the river and bathing with a bar of ivory soap after picking a field of tobacco. That's my craziest summer memory, which I at the time hated, but now I'm like, wow, I did that. That's bananas. Probably traveling to Jamaica with my family. I remember this one time uh, we went snorkeling together. It's actually kind of it's a it's a it's a dark comedy memory. We were snorkeling all together. My mom like got attacked by some fire coral, and like she was trying to help me swim. So I was just struggling like crazy. But it was crazy because I was looking at a whole bunch of beautiful like life in the ocean, and my mom was like trying to get her foot to work, you know. But I was there with my family. We were in the grill, and it was just so beautiful. I love spending time with my family and traveling with my family. So definitely, definitely Jamaica. I feel like the summer that I was a camp counselor at summer camp. No way. Yeah. Dude, right? I know. I was like, I was 15 or 16. Who left me in charge of children? It's crazy. To be honest, a lot of my memories are just like playing with my neighbor, my next door neighbor. We would like make little videos, like little skits and stuff on like a little video camera, which is so like, I feel like in kind of related to the show, like just carrying around a little video camera. Um, so that's maybe that, or going to the beach with my family. You know, I actually got asked this before, and I was like, I kind of had a boring childhood because I can't think of anything right now. Um, I just remember hanging out with my parents a lot because I'm an only child, so like when summer break hits, me and my parents were like this. And I loved it, but I'm sure they were kind of sick of me towards the end. They were like waiting for me to go back to school. But I feel like my parents are a really big part of my childhood and like summer tonight. breaks. All in one place would have been when we wrapped. I've seen some of them uh, individually, but not everybody everywhere all at once until tonight. Oh yeah. Everybody get some Yeah. Yeah, it well it's it, it, there's no experience like watching it with an audience. That's when you know how it's going to be received. When you watch with an audience, that tells you everything. So I'm excited. I love this cast and everybody looks so incredible and I'm just like really I'm so excited to be able to like go in. Yeah, it's a lot going on, but I'm so excited to like go in and just celebrate with them. Sadie is literally my bestest friend. Lexi is literally my bestest friend. 
I don't even consider them my castmates. They're at, at this point, they're my bestest friends. And it's so crazy seeing them in this space because it's like, oh wait, we're not just regular old friends. We're actually castmates and we made a show together. Um, so, I mean, I got so blessed with the most amazing girls um, and they will be my bestest friends for life. I love them. Like I could start crying. I love them so much. It's actually crazy though that you did a show together but you also like are actually best friends. We're actually best friends. I mean, we filmed every single day and you would think that you would want some alone time, but like right when the weekend hits, we're like, all right, so what's the plans? What are the girls doing? We filmed in Vancouver. We did film in Vancouver. What did you do on like the weekend? Ooh, we went out because because me and Lexi are legal in Canada, so we went out, uh, went dancing. Uh, it was so fun, and we uh, we actually lived in an apartment together, so we had like game nights and just like everyone came over. It was like kind of like a frat house. It got kind of gross towards the end. <laughs> yeah. Summer or winter? Winter. Yeah, I just felt like going for the controversial answer, I felt like. Also, I like layers. And I live in LA where it's always hot, so I'm like trying to switch it up. You know what I mean? TikTok or IG Reels? IG Reels, I guess. Yeah. I'm one of those, I know. I know. I know. Lisa, Lisa judges me very hard. She lets me know often. <laughs> Yeah, 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 me. No, she gives me so much crap for it. <laughs> okay, FaceTime or text? FaceTime. So you will answer? You don't care? Most of the time, yeah. No, never camera ready, but like, my real friend's like, I'm fine looking ugly in front of it. It's fine. Early call time or late call time? Early call time. You're up early? No, I, no, I mean like, I don't like waking up early, but I like getting off early. And I have like a full day to do whatever I want. Relive the past or know your future? Okay, can I change the past or just relive it? Just relive it. Yeah. Change the future. Or no, no, yeah, know the future. Summer camp? <laughs> no. You want to do it again? No, actually no. Okay, know the future. Know the future, yeah. Outer Banks or Stranger Things? Outer Banks, shout out Madison Bailey. And then playlist or podcast? Playlist. Right now? Um, and then also, oh man, okay, what's one that's gonna like make me sound cool? Oh my god. We spent so much time together. We're gonna leave that up to you. What you think? Artist, you artist. Oh, Mac Miller, anytime. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. That sounds cool. You're yeah, good. all right, cool. Summer or winter? Winter. The clothes, the clothes, you know? TikTok or IG Reels? TikTok. Who is on IG Reels? <laughs> Not me. FaceTime or text? Ooh. Text. Because I'm not always camera ready. You know? Fair. Yeah. Don't FaceTime me. Don't FaceTime me. I need a warning. <laughs> Early call time or late call time? Late. I want to sleep in as long as I can. I'm a night owl. Big sleeper. Relive your past or know your future? Know my future. I've been through some. Um, I don't think I want to relive that again. So know my past. I'm, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Outer Banks or Stranger Things? Ooh, that's so tough. I think Outer Banks. I think Outer Banks. That came out more recently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then last one, playlist or podcast? Playlist. Ooh, no. Mm. Lately, I've been on my podcast game. I love a lot of true crime podcasts. I don't know if you watch Bailey Syrian, but she's my favorite. Um, I'm like listening to the most darkest, goriest <laughs> true crime podcast while I'm getting ready. But yeah, I love it. So usually playlists, but for today, podcasts. Yeah.